Okay, hello everyone, it's Salar and welcome back to this tutorial. In this tutorial, we want to find out how can we use OTP Artos in STM32CubeID. In previous part, I talked about thread priority, but in this part, I want to introduce uh, I want to introduce you another system call in the Artos, but the system call is thread suspend. Thread suspend. But what does thread suspend system call do? What does this function do in the Artos? You know, by using a thread wait, you can stop running up a thread for a specified time, for a delay time. Okay, delay is a specified time, for example, 500 milliseconds, 2000 milliseconds, or more. But by using a thread suspend, you can stop running up a thread, stop running up a thread for an unspecified time. For an unspecified time. But let's to see an example. Here is an example. I have two threads, thread one and thread two. The priority of thread 1 is high and priority of thread 2 is normal. And this is the implementation of thread functions. In thread function 1, I want to suspend the running of thread 1 by using a thread suspend function or system call. Okay, so let's do. Uh, build the project and debug that. The project has been built with nowhere. Let's do debug that. Okay, now I'm in debug mode. If I run the code, Operating system jump to thread function one with higher priority than thread with priority high. But if I run this function thread suspend to suspend thread one, the operating system jump to thread function two because now thread one has suspended. If I delete this bridge point. If I uh, delete this breakpoint and run the code, the Artos doesn't return to thread function 1 and always run thread function 2. You know thread function 2 has a lower priority. The priority of thread function 2 is normal, but always the Artos run thread 2. Why? Because thread 1 has been suspended for an unspecified time. Okay? And at this time, the Artos just run thread function 2. But how can I, how can I return thread 1 to ready list and run that? Let's do, stop it. And back to the slide. By using up another uh, system call or Artos function, you can return a suspended thread to ready list by using a thread resume system call. Thread uh, thread resume system call. Okay, let's see an example. Now, if I Add another line here and resume thread one another time to the ready list. We can another time run thread function two. Okay, so uh, let's do this project and debug that okay 
Now the project has been built with no error and no warnings. Let's do debug the project. Okay, if I run the code, the Artos jump to thread function run. But if run this line thread suspend, the operating system jump to thread function 2 because thread suspended by this system call. Thread 1 suspended by this system call. Now, if I resume, so if I raise another time thread 1, we can see here is thread 1. To the ready list, the Artos immediately return to thread function 1. Because thread function 1 has higher priority than thread function 2. I stop running the thread function 2 and immediately return to thread function 1. Now, if I run the code, the Artos will not jump to thread function 2 and will not run thread function 2 at this time after resuming because now another time thread function 1 is in ready list and has higher priority than thread function 2 okay so by using a thread suspend you can stop running up a thread from a specified time and by using a thread resume you can return the suspended thread to the ready list this was the introduction uh, this was an introduction about thread suspend and thread resume in the articles okay thank you very much to see me and see you soon in the next part